Yes. Very well. I will hear you out, but only for the sake of the Commonwealth. Sparks, with me! Let's discuss this amicably. I think it's time you ditched that mask and faced me. You're right. It's time I faced the true enemy of the Commonwealth. There. Now we both know who we're dealing with. Hey, I'm not the enemy. I'm the one trying to protect the Commonwealth against your robots. They have taken innocent lives. My friends, they were simple traitors. All dead at the hands of your robots. That can't be right. Explain yourself. They're misinterpreting orders. Your own robo-brain said as much. They're saving people by killing them. Saving by... killing? No. It's... the logic. It's there. I can see it now. I was hoping it was the robo-brains, an issue with their memory wipes. But you're right. <sighs> their primary directive was flawed. The robo-brains require memory wipes? Yes. The human brain has a way of rewiring itself. If not properly maintained, it, it can corrupt. That sounds like a serious flaw. And a dangerous one at that. It is. But the process is thorough. They're wiped after each mission. They're... I found it's best not to let them recall what they've been through. Well, your technicality cost a lot of innocent people their lives. Judging from the numbers in the data dump, if even a small percentage are innocents, I wanted to help the Commonwealth. And robots are all I know. I found this place and figured I could finally do my part. I accept full responsibility. I can't take back what I've done, or even atone for it. But this doesn't have to end in violence. I'm not here to kill you, only to get you and your robots to stand down. Done, consider it done. And you won't regret this. I promise. None of the Commonwealth will. Here, take this. It's the password to the mainframe. You can use it to shut down the security protocols. I just... I'd rather this place be in your hands now. <laughs> 